The vestige awakens once again. Come here. Here, we must, must change your bandages. As I feared, we arrived in different locations. I am in a city near the sea, in a land of eternal spring. The air smells of the ocean and of markets and gardens. It matters not. You have awakened once again, and we must set you on your path. The voyage between worlds was both chaotic and violent. It deposited us in Tamriel, but some distance apart, and quite unceremoniously upon our heads. I lost consciousness myself for a time. For the time being, your journey must continue without me. Venture outside, explore this new place, and learn what you can. Expose the agents of Molog Bar, wherever you find them, for their means are perfidious, and their scheming ever present. I cannot foresee that, not yet. But we will meet again. There is still much we need to accomplish. Remember, the agents of Moloch Bob are everywhere. Tread carefully. I must confess this place is unknown to me. You appear to have arrived on a tropical island on the side of a ship. Explore this place. Speak to the locals. I sense that the catmen of elsewhere are present. She may be in their territory. When I have found the safe haven, I will contact you again. Until then, be safe. Unless you're in serious pain, I can't help you right now. I have too many patients to attend. You're there. Wet one. This one needs to speak to you. We need your face to become familiar, so your presence won't be questioned. Come, stay by my side. This one saw you fall from thin air. Pop, drop, splash. Roz would have tried for a backflip, but under the circumstances, this one is most impressed. There are many Dominion soldiers here. Rattled by the shipwreck. They may think you are a spy. That could end... Uh, badly. Raz knows you are not a spy. He does not want your impressive arrival to go unrewarded. First, a question. Where did you come from? A Daedric prince, you say? Raz has a nose for lies, but you seem clean as an ocean breeze. Hmm. If anyone else asks you, where will you say you came from? Yes, lie with confidence. A straight face and a gleam in your eye. Well done. It is very good right now to fit in. Your sudden arrival, it does not fit in, you understand? You should not. You should trust your instincts. Live if you wish. No one will stop you. Or, come with Raz and do what you can to help us recover. In the process, grow your stature and wealth. It is entirely up to you. Because you are no soldier, which is useful. You can speak with the locals, assure them we are not invaders or marauders. Now come, let us try to fit in. Two steps forward, two steps back. Why are we cursed with such a task? Ah, so much to do, so little time. Commander Karanet, a moment. This recruit survived the shipwreck without injuries. You mentioned something about the Shattered Shoals, yes? Glad you're up and about, recruit. I'm in need of a scout to head to Shattered Shoals. Most of our fleet foundered to the west, but we've had a few survivors trickle in from that direction. We captured a Sea Viper spying on the camp. Those pirates never travel alone. Find out if they're around Shattered Shoals, and if so, what they're doing on this island. Of course, you should assist any shipwreck survivors you find. We must each do our part. Before you head to Shattered Shoals, speak with Eelsil. He just returned from exploring a nearby temple. That wizard claims to know something about everything. 
So he may have insight on how these sea vipers operate. Il seal is this way. Hey. Il seal, this recruit wishes to speak with you. Marvelous, isn't it? We'll have to construct a special room for the Morning Stone when we bring it back to the Mages Guild. I'm sorry, did you need something? Yes, the Temple of the Morning Springs is an old Khajiit ruin not far from here. We excavated the Morning Stone from one of the chambers. As you can see, its supply of water appears endless. What do you mean, pirates? In an ancient Khajiit temple? Preposterous! All we saw were the undead warriors that overran our camp. I have no idea. Actually, I have twelve ideas, but they're far less fascinating than the Morning Stone. Probably some sort of ancient curse. It usually is with these things. Arrogant sea elf pirates. To my recollection, they aren't known to raid Kanathi's roost. Oh, and they have a thing for snakes. But I'm sure we both have more important matters to attend. Uh, if you'd excuse me? We should speak privately. Before you depart, let's meet by the statues, Lord. The moon sent me too much work. There, you see? You fit in and no one will stop you from walking away. But, as this one said, there are opportunities here for people that fall from the sky. Il Seal is most impressed with his newest bubble. But the undead are a threat to all of Canarthi's roost. If you want to, you could search the Temple of the Morning Springs, determine how to contain the dead there. Then the locals should see we came here as allies, not conquerors. Karanith told you how the hurricane dashed the fleet into Canarthi's roost. Now the sea vipers are picking at the bones of our ships. Strange, yes? You could scout the coast, as the commander said. Prove yourself to the soldiers. Oh, there's far less glamorous work to be done in Mistral, at the northern end of the island. Let's meet up there, after you've done what you decide to do. Until then, bright moons guide your steps. What? <laughs> Staying out of trouble? <laughs> <laughs> 